just came in the mail. My son ordered two more fishing reels for me. As you all know, two weeks ago, <laughs> I lost three of my fishing reels and rods. My kayak clip. What was that? What was it? An ex experience day that I had to face losing. But luckily, it's <laughs> not my life. I live to fish another day. So, so this came in the mail, and I want to do the unboxing impressions and uh, this is piece of and I've been fishing with this reel this is a big caster for three years now my son I think original is probably around a hundred you can look up I'm not sure but he got it for me around close to $80 or whatever. And the gear ratio is 8, 1, 1, uh, 36, something, 70, 33 pounds of drags and all that. And uh, yeah, let's open this up. Before I got this one, before, my, this really my first time that I using the bait cancer my friend Jesse recommend to me he been using this with five six seven years or whatever and he loves it so he recommended to me as instruction and yeah and so I bought the first one he did mentioned me a power handle. I didn't know what that is. There was whatever. So I got it a double handle, a uh, normal handle, not the power handle one. And uh, uh, this one is the power handle. Well, it's hot. The wheel looks very nice. And uh, I really like it. Very smooth. It looks so nice compared to those uh, Daiwa or Shimano. This is the low profile one. This is the 300 Allegure and uh, I had it almost three years. Have no problem with it. I really like this. They cast a lot and I would recommend to anybody starting kayak fishing or whatever fishing give this reel a try you know this company a try not like I'm affiliate with them or you know they sponsor them whatever but this is my personal opinion I, I use this reel and very affordable compared to, to those high-end reels I, I had. Well, I don't want to say that I have the high-end reel because my all the reels, I, reels that I use never over, exceed over 350. I don't know if you call it a 350 as a high-end reel. I never like a five hundred or a thousand dollar reels. No, not that kind of uh, fisherman. And uh, I do like nice reels too, but but I think some of those it's just the name. I didn't have a good luck with the Shimano. I used to have those uh, Shimano. What? I forgot. It's around three close to. Well, 350 is those range and they didn't last me that good. I had a, a little better luck than with Daiwa and uh, I use Quantum 
Cabo, or something like that. PT Cabo, whatever. It's too heavy. But this rail is very nice, as you can see, and very smooth. And so, I don't know, you guys give me a, a suggestion, whatever. But this is just like bottom fishing. I don't cast a lot of it. Uh, what kind, what type of test pound should I use? I had mine before, like a 20 pound, but I think I could go over 20 pound or maybe put a 50 pounds maybe because it just dropped to the bottom. I don't cast that good on this anyway. I'm not really a professional, you know. So, yeah, but this reel, I recommend it. it it's very nice. I had the 400 too, but the 400 it looked bigger. I ordered the 400 because it had auto click or whatever, it's more powerful. I was going to use that for the striper fishing this uh, coming season, this season right now. I, I, went, I went for it, the other day I caught a 42 inch. I did not make a video. It's too hard to make the video in the dark. So with all the kayak, with all the boat fishermen there, I don't want to do it. So they say, you turn on the light, you scare the fish or whatever. And so I didn't make the video. And anyway, the 400, I lost the 400, I lost the 300, and then the pin slimer for, the pin slimer can, bought, can buy the 400, the 400 if not sell, it's like 199, but it sell 150, and this one like 150, my son get it for me like around maybe $80. So this is Alejo, the 300 low profile. I really love this reel. I want it in black and red because I have the gold one already. But my son said that they don't uh, have the power handle. I can't get with the power handle. So I might get the red and black, just uh, those normal two handle. It could be worth fun. And anyway, I really like this reel. That's why I go back to this reel. I'm not gonna buy another, you know, like Chimano, Daiwa, or Pen or whatever. I'm done with those high price reel. I don't want, it. if I lose it, it's not really a heartbreaking, you know. So, this is Alijo 300, so. So, I'm gonna open the other one. This one is new. Uh, no tech or something like that. You see this guy? No tech 5,000. 5, uh, 5.4 one and uh, the nine, 9 bearing, I think. And 4 centimeter. I don't know. I don't know if you can read all this. But anyway, this is new one. I tried to say it on YouTube or read the view about it. A couple, just couple review, uh, common re review on it. They say it's, it's good. So I haven't seen any YouTube video. So I'm gonna do the unboxing with this new Hispan uh, aluminum with the instruction and the real is of the five thousand. Look big. I thought it's not that big. I would. Have, I don't really like big rail, but this is going to be good for striper. I think I'm going to use this for striper, or maybe to talk to, or anything. But I wish I get a four thousand. Man, this is big. This is big. And, uh, you're not going to cast with this. Man, if I like a lot, I'd maybe get a 3,000 or 4,000. But look at this, you guys. It's beautiful. It looked like a $500 or three. Check that sound out. It's very nice, huh? I put the handle, I like that.
the knob, the round knob. My pin slam I had the round knob. It's in the bottom of the ocean right now. The ocean thief stole my <laughs> stole my gear. Almost stole my life too. It's so nice, yeah. Wow. It is too big, man. I, I kind of, I kind of regret about this. It's so heavy for kayak fishing. Dang, man. That is heavy duty. Imagine you get a 6,000 or over that there. It's heavy too. Wow. Sounds very nice, yeah. Now this one, maybe I spool it up with the uh, 50 pound braid. Oh, that's so nice. Man, that's just heavy, it's just big. Kind of fishing? No, man. What you guys think? Let me know the 5,000 size. Man, it, it sounds nice. Damn, dude. Oh, look, it's so nice. So nice. This is new. There's no, uh, doesn't have any video yet. So it just came out a couple months, a couple months ago. So. Alright, I'm going to test it out this weekend, put some line up and see how it handles fish. Oh man, how damn that is heavy. That was so casting, yeah, it's going to hurt your hand too. Wow. Feel like you fish for tuna or something. Yeah. I heard one comment say the 5,000 spoon is big or heavier than the 6,000, one guy said. And I think Pistaphone tell them back that uh, the spoon is bigger than the, the 6,000. How can it be? You guys, yeah, this is the unboxing my new arsenal and hope this time, well, you're going to lose it somehow, I guess, even if you lease it or whatever. I'm going to try to lease it. Man, that thing is heavy. That thing is heavy. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. Maybe I get a 3,000 or 4,000. My son, it's a 99, my son got it around $70. It's a good deal. He bought it online, Amazon or something like that. Wow. It feel ready, sturdy, ready. Aluminum cut or whatever the car is. Machine cut, it looks so smooth, looks so nice. It looks probably look look and feel better than my print slimer. Alright guys. That's all there is. Thank you you guys very much. My two new reel. I've been going out my last trip after accident used my old reel. So but this one's gonna test it out this weekend. Maybe do a six month review, whatever. I really like this real uh, uh, It came in the small box here. <laughs> came with the wrap like this. Yeah, I guess 
they didn't cost that much. Why bother to put double box or whatever? And the big one came with this male, male uh, envelope or whatever. All right, you guys. Thank you, you guys, very much for like and share and subscribe to my channel. And thank you for all the concern and care about me, what happened on the water there. I really appreciate you guys. All this kayak community, people that really care for one another and uh, just comfort me. And I really appreciate it. You guys, I read all the comments and try to answer all the comments and all the feedback, something like that. And re really appreciate it, you guys. Thank you very much. And yeah, uh, be safe on the water. Always, always wear your PFD, the most important. Go with friends. And if you're going to go alone, make sure you have your radio. You can call for help. And make sure you don't go too far. Make sure you check the weather report. I mean, there's other options. You don't go onto the open ocean. You can go to the like in a bay. You know, you don't have to go in the middle of the ocean or whatever. All right, you guys. Thank you very much for like and share and subscribe to my channel. And I really appreciate it because of you guys. I still wanna keep making more video. I don't benefit any. I just like to share because. When I start making this video, I've been watching other people before, uh, all those professional people. I met Mr. Robert Field on the water at Narragansett, Rhode Island. You know, field trip with Robert Field. I was in one of his videos. So he inspired me to make the video. I do read other comments that some people they say that I inspire them, uh, you know, and I really like that. And I, if I can inspire somebody to do something, you know, uh, that is the greatest thing, greatest feeling. So thank you again. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, enjoy the outdoor safe and take care. Goodbye. Thailand, see you on the water. Bye-bye.